Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to 40 Runs. Now, if this is your first time at 40 Runs, I want you to smash that pink button down there that says subscribe on it. Go to our Facebook page and join the 40 Runs running community and check out the description. All of today's winners are going to be linked up down there in the description. Right, so it's that time of year, 2020 running awards. Let's get stuck in. Right guys, so the 40 Runs Running Awards 2020. Now all the winners have been picked by the people in the 40 Runs Running Community. In our running communities online, we've got about 10, well we've got over 10,000 runners now. But I've asked the guys in the main 40 Runs Running Community, which is just under 6,000 uh, runners, everyday runners, we've got all abilities in there. We've got people who do eight hour marathons and two and a half hour marathons. We've got people who are doing couch to 5K. We've got people who just concentrate on 10Ks. We've got everybody in there, but we've got the real runners in there, the real consumers in there, and the guys who spend their money on races, events, shoes, and on all other stuff. So I asked them uh, to pick their winners in each of our categories, and here's how they got on. Right, guys, so our first category is favourite running clothing brand. Now, there was loads uh, that the guys came up with, but there was only one winner. Right, guys, and the winner is Tickaboo. Now, in the 40 Runs Running community, we absolutely love Tickaboo. Um, we actually love it so much that we actually got our own made. Uh, you may see some people at, at some of your events and races, they've got 40 runs Tickaboos on. We love Tickaboo. Uh, it's just great quality gear. Um, they do leggings, uh, shorts and capris and all sorts of other stuff. But this year's winner is Tickaboo. Right, next up, our award for the best 5K. Now, this was a tough one because there was loads out there and we even had some park runs uh, sneak in as well. But the winner for the 5K is... The Run Through Chase the Sun. Now, if you've not done one of these Run Through events, they are awesome. They're in London um, and they do uh, Chase the Sun, Chase the Moon and all these kind of stuff. And you can do a 5K, 10K uh, and they're at different places, but like in Wimbledon at the Olympic Park and all that sort of stuff. But they are so well organised. They're so well put on. The people at Run Through are just amazing people. They're runners and they get it. So congratulations, Run Through. Chase the Sun is the 40 runs running uh, awards 2020 best 5K. Our next category is our favourite 10K. And again, there was loads up and down the country. There was so many people's picked so many different events, but there was only one winner. And the 2020 award goes to the Vitality 10,000 or 10K. We love that event, mainly because the, <laughs> the medal this year was in pink. But also we had a big team of volunteers out there this year and they all got pink coats and everything like that. And it was just a wicked event. So if you're looking to do a really good 10K, sign up for the Vitality 10K. Right guys, next up is Half Marathon. Our favourite Half Marathon was... The London Landmarks Half Marathon. Congratulations, that is an amazing event. It raises a load of money for Tommy's, which is an amazing charity. Uh, it's just an awesome event. If you can't um, get in, try and get in through a charity because it really is a great event. We can't recommend it enough. So congratulations, Landmarks London, you win our best half marathon. Right, so our 2020 awards continue and next up is our favourite marathon. Right, there was a, I mean, there was loads. Um, I mean, they was literally, we had ones all over the world, marathons. Um, but the one that came out on top should probably be no surprise, and that was London. So congratulations, Virgin Money London Marathon. You're our top marathon for 2020. Right, so next up is our best overall event. Uh, and it can be 5K to half marathon to an ultra marathon, anything like that. And here's who won. Congratulations to the Great North Front. We absolutely love the Great North Front in the 40 Runs community. I mean, love it. Uh, I think this year we had 2,000 of us go up and do it, <laughs> which is insane. But it is such a great event. If you can do the Great North Run, I can't recommend it enough. So congratulations, Great North Run, our best overall event. Next up is the most underrated event. Uh, and this was a funny one I threw at the guys. Uh, but they came up with some absolute corkers. The Olympic Park Half. Congratulations to the guys again at Run Through. We absolutely loved the Olympic Park Half and we can't wait to get back there in February. If you've not seen it or checked it out, it's held at the Olympic Park uh, in Stratford, for, which was the host of the 2012 Olympics. Um, the guys at Run Through put on the half marathon last year for the first time. It's so cool. It's got a wicked little event village. It's just really well organised. It's a great route. It's nice and flat. Uh, it's easy parking. It's easy getting to there for the train. I say it's just a super cool event. It's not too expensive, it's well attended, and we can't wait to get back there next year. Right, next up is our most favourite running watch, uh, and this was just the easiest one ever. And the winner is the Garmin 235. Despite new additions from Garmin this year, the Garmin 235 still came out on top. So congratulations, Garmin. 
Right, so our next award is for the best finishers t-shirt. <laughs> and the, guy, the guys had a bit of a field day on this one. It was, there was, I wouldn't say arguments, but there was a lot of chat about which one was best and which wasn't best. Some people weren't too fussed about getting t-shirts as well. We got into all that, but actually we found one winner. Right, and the winner is the Royal Parks Half Marathon. They sent us a super cool t-shirt this year. It was a purple one. It was totally awesome. Um, I'm still wearing mine from the event. And I say, there's just a really nice quality about it. It's got a great logo on the back. It's just a wicked t-shirt. So the next one is the best shoe brand. Uh, I thought that it would go to somebody that it didn't go to, but this is who won. Right, so the winner of our favourite shoe brand from the 40 Runs Runner community is Brooks, which was a bit of a surprise to me. I didn't think it would be Brooks, but congratulations, Brooks. You are our favourite shoe brand. And our final award, and it's probably the most important, is the best race bling. Now, <laughs> this is the most important thing to any runner, is the race medal that you get at the end of it. And here is the winner. And the winner is the Virgin Money London Marathon. Congratulations, guys, at London Marathon. The, the guys in the community just adore the Virgin Money London Marathon medal, probably because it, take, it takes uh, a lot of training, a lot, a lot of uh, sacrifice, big commitment to get it. And obviously, it's hard to get into in the first place. But when the guys got hold of it, they absolutely loved it. So congratulations. So there you go, guys. There are our 2020 winners. Uh, congratulations to everybody who won. I say these are voted for by real people, real runners, the guys who are buying the shoes, signing up for the events, taking part in all the stuff. These are the guys that matter. So there you go. There are our winners from 2020. I'll see you next year.